Hi again, everybody, and welcome to this week's Orange Perspective. And a little perspective right about now is good for all of us. You remember 2008, the last time Hawaii came to Reeser Stadium. The Beavers entered that game 0-2 and won big, 45-7, found their stride and went on to compete for the Rose Bowl all the way to the end of the campaign. So the Beavers are hoping for that kind of bounce back against the Rainbow Warriors. You may recall the quarterback that day in 2008 was none other than Lyle Moivau. We had a chance to talk to the Beavers graduate intern about his memories from that day. Hit by Norris. Beavers on a big blitz and they get to Fanaki. Lyle steps up away from pressure, throws to Rogers on the delay. Rogers into the second air. 40, breaks a tackle and is on his way. 20, 15, 10, 5. Touchdown, Beavers. It was a good game for us on offense and defense. I knew that as an offense, we did have a chance of making big plays, especially with our receiving core of James and, and Sammy Strotter and Shane Morales. So I knew all I had to do was go out there and make sure that I got the ball down the field to the right receivers and, and we'd be good to go. Loibau sends James Rogers in motion to quiz. They hand off to Quinn Strutter, steps in, drives in! Touchdown, Beavers! I think leading up to the Hawaii game, Quiz was starting to catch his momentum and get comfortable. I know Penn State, he, he was, uh, a little doubtful and knowing the playbook and a little unsure at times and hesitant. And so Hawaii was really the chance for him to push beyond what was expected and, and he did so. Jaquiz, the handoff and Mr. Touchdown is in again. The main difference between when I was playing and now is that the coaches are deciding to throw the ball down a lot more. Um, and it's not to say that we didn't have the right receiving crew or not the right quarterbacks. Um, I just think that, you know, it fits our quarterbacks that we have now as well as our receivers that we have now. You know, we still fix in the run game and still have the fly sweep, so it's not a whole lot of change, but there's a few tweaks. One thing that made me want to coach or get into coaching, you get a chance to teach younger, younger players how to become better at something that they may have known their whole life, whether it's just teaching them a different step to take or a different way to look. Uh, something so small can make such a big difference, and that's what I want to be a part of. Going back to 2008, after coming off of a tough loss, I think that one thing that we can see that's still the same with this team that we're playing against with Hawaii is that they're going to come and they're going to play together as a family, and they're going to play close as a family and as brothers. So we have to make sure that we are playing together just as well as they are, if not better. Well, that was a great day to be a Beaver. 45-7 win, Jacquez rushes for 110, and the Beavers got on a great roll after that, which included a victory over number one, USC. We're hoping to see these stands behind me full of citizens of Beaver Nation this weekend, a five o'clock kick, Oregon State hosting Hawaii right here and all across the Beaver Sports Network. So long, everybody.